don't believe everything they say on the media because they telling you not to come. But those other people, they coming. While you sitting home afraid and staying back and stuff, they they steady piling up and they coming on the drove, just flying over and just scaring y'all to stay where y'all at. But it's not true to what they say because think about this: Why would they go somewhere if it was so bad? But yet they telling you it's bad. So you see, it's all tricks. It's all tricks. We here. I'm here, and it's for real. Hey, what's up, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. My name is Eko Simpson. I'm a Ghanaian. Um, and I live in Ghana. Well, you are watching this channel because somebody introduced you to it. It was recommended or suggested to you on YouTube. Basically, my YouTube channel is to connect Africans and the motherland to Africans in the diaspora. So, thank you for checking me out. If this is your first time of watching my videos, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel. Actually, hey, what's up everybody? Thank you for checking me out. My name is Epo Simpson. And, uh, yeah. Hey, we'll bring it. Put him in my house. Bless him. Oh, oh, you're trying to Ah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 you got it, you got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, and uh, I love when I hear the Hebrews. Mm -hmm. Who are the Hebrews? Hebrews. People of the Bible. People of the book. Story. Okay. The Israelites. The Israelites. Okay. So, welcome to God. Oh. Does, does oh, Ghana, okay. <laughs> does being in Ghana feel like you are there? Or there's a difference? No, I feel like I'm... It feel good being here. It feel like, yeah, it feel like we're home. Well, what about you? Man, it's, yeah, I, feel, I ain't gonna lie, I feel free. That's all. That's the main thing I can say about being a gunner. When I come on this side of the waters and I'm right in front of the water, I just feel like I'm free. That's all. I just feel like I escape. You feel me? I feel like I'm free. All right, beautiful. So, uh, you know, here you got for that purpose. And uh, when we took the picture, you were like, you're gonna show your face and say, hey, those of you who didn't want to come now, everything is on point, everything is working. Hmm. What was behind them having that skeptic idea not to come and not to believe what is going on? In oh, what they say on TV, you know, the media scares them not to come, but I don't believe everything they say on the media because they're telling you not to come, but those other people, they coming. While you sitting home, afraid, and staying back and stuff, they, they steady piling up and they coming on the drove, just flying over and just scaring y'all to stay where y'all at. But it's not true to what they say because think about this why would they go somewhere if it was so bad but yet they're telling you it's bad so you see it's all tricks it's all tricks we here i'm here and it's for real i know god box brought you to cape coast mm -hmm. um what is the experience like i mean is this your first time in Ghana? yes so how was it like i mean people i see people when they get to the from the plane mm -hmm. they step on the grounds and they, they like they start crying and all that there's a certain feeling did you ever feel something, anything? I just was happy. I was happy to be here. <laughs> I was happy before I got here. I was just happy knowing yeah. that I was on my way. Uh -huh. So that's the joy that I had before I got there. And when I got here, you know, it was just like a, 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 a big breath of relief and stuff, knowing that, hey, I finally made it and stuff. Finally, finally made, made it to stay? Yeah, stay. So you're staying? Yes, I ain't That means back. you will need to either build, get a land. Right. And you've heard of that civil traditional oh, council so giving out free land to diaspora yes mm -hmm. what is going on with that you oh. might have had something when he came oh oh i mean i heard all kinds of stuff but on my own research and my own study it was it was good man i mean i looked at it i've seen other videos with other people i investigated and stuff and i said hey i'm, I'm gonna get a piece of that and stuff and i came knowing you know some would say that oh you might don't like it you know you sure you want to go but i said i'm gonna like it and I'm and I'm gonna enjoy it, and I'm gonna build from there. I'm gonna grow, you know. With, it, with life, you know, we have our different trials and tribulations, but we're able to overcome that. Especially when it's something that you desire, you got in your heart that you want to do, that you know is right. You're being led, you know, by the spirit and stuff. And so that's why we pushed our way to come on out here and stuff. No matter all the negatives what people had, we overlooked that and just pushed our way on. Yes, so. But I see you are now um, a game changer to that perception of them not coming. So then what are you going to do about it? I mean, there should be 
you have been here, mm -hmm. you are here already experiencing it. So what are you going to do to make sure, no, hey, whatever they were saying out there, it is not true. Oh, I'm, Hey, I'm video on taping my experience and stuff. I'm putting it up on YouTube. I'm putting it on Facebook and stuff. You know, just to show proof that, you know, it ain't just hearsay. For those that know me personally and stuff, hey, I'm here and I'm living a life. And I'm being that and I'm showing you that. You know that experience, the example and stuff that's going on. That it is real. It's not a scam or anything. All right, sir. No, keep out of it. Oh yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. I see you to be one of the younger brothers who are now here. Yeah. You've also had some experiences and all that. What are you telling the younger brothers who are watching? What I'm telling the younger brothers, I'll just tell them. Really, man, go to GodBoxTours.com. Really, tap in with bro. And like I say, not only are they gonna bring you on the tour, but you are gonna get to come and experience Africa and really Ghana. Like you saying, I just tell people you can't say Africa no more. Too many countries, but Ghana really the main one. You gotta come see. You know, you gotta come through Africa, get your introduction to Africa through Ghana. And um, like I say, tap in with the right people, and not only are you gonna get a chance to go on the tour, but you are gonna go on the tour and be able to come back with a piece of land. So that was like the thing that appealed to me the most. You know, I was really interested in the land. I heard about this Sabu project. So I'm trying to get to the bottom of it, find out who I need to talk to to get the land. So not only, you know, they got me the application and all that right there. So told me to fill all that out before I came. So pretty much it made it easy for me to contact the disabled people, you know, get it, meet with them, you know, go out there, see the land. So pretty much that's what my experience been. I done came, got it welcome back and was able to go on tour, see the castle, see all the important landmarks of black history, really. And also get some land at the same time. So that's what I was really trying to most interested in me. Like I tell everybody else, you want to do the same thing. You know, okay. you want to book that tour All right. and come back and get your land Shit. and uh, claim. You know, get your piece of history, your yeah. legacy. You yeah. feel me? Like that's a part of Africa. You feel me? A part of Ghana. You know what I'm saying? Shit. Part of our history, a part of our culture. So All right. I feel deeply about all that. All right. So let's go to the Asebu community. Meet the chief, what? and then we'll show you. Meet the chief. All right. Hey,